action. Okay, well, welcome back to Let's Play Zelda to the Adventure of Link. You can walk on water! Yes, that is right. I picked up the boots. That way we can bypass those fucking random battle scenes. You're Jesus. Yes, I'm a Jesus metaphor. Now I'm trying to, um, get to Palace 5. Does that mean you can break the game now with walking everywhere? No. <laughs> of course there's a game genie code. Now, I'm gonna turn the fairy because why not? Now, reason why I stopped here? Heart container. Heart container. Now and you're seven. Now I would just need one more heart piece, which that won't come until later. Now let me go um get back off this water. It's only you. This is only used for that for this particular part. Now and can you not use the water thingy again ever? No. We're in Palace Five. Now this is the American exclusive palace, so to say. American exclusive. Yes, the bosses change and some enemies are changed in the palace. And the in the Japanese version, it's oh P. It the palace color was white, not um green. Green. And I and ladies and gentlemen, I hate this palace of overall. I hate this palace. Um. So why was this palace changed? I don't know. I guess Miyamoto wasn't happy. With it, or you know, or it would have been too hard, because you know us American gamers. But isn't that the reason why we didn't get Super Mario, uh, the real Super Mario too? Yes. Which I don't know. I'm a, I don't know if I'm gonna be playing that. Oh God. Yeah, I had to go back to get that key. Yeah, I was gonna say you did forget that key. Well, I was a fairy, and yes, now my sword's powered up. I'm gonna take on some bubbles. Fucking bubbles, man! Give my magic. So that's what they do? Yeah, they take your magic. So, go on this bridge, this kind of looks... Oh, no. Medusa heads! It gets uh, Castlevania. Uh, <laughs> I missed that tea bag. Yeah, it wasn't worth it. <laughs> Think I was gonna go in there? I just hope, um, this palace doesn't, like, loop around with the recycled room. Let's hope not. Yeah. Cause that, would, that would be so confusing. Get this iron knuckle right here. I like how you can just stab those guys and they don't try to fight back after you break, break one block. <laughs> well, yeah, and it's a kind of a um, technique I use fighting them. Yep, these are old hags. Old hags? This is Van. Ugly old hags. Like, why are there just a bunch of random old hags trying to kill you in here? I don't know. I guess because I killed their husband. Uh, their husbands in the arm. Um... Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Yeah. The trick is to downstab them. They give you 200 experience points, in which I grind. <laughs> it seemed kind of annoying to kill. Yes. Because they um appear disappear. Pretty much the same strategy as the wiz robes in um Palace Four or the Blue Fox Clan. So yeah, I grind in this palace. I grind in this palace too. Palace, um, four, five, and six are my my favorite spots to grind, other than Death Mountain. But I digress. Oh, let me get that key. Even though it's fifty, I still take it. So how how much of those bags of pee can to give you for experience? Okay, for small enemies, um, fifty. Like like bigger enemies, like that those old hags. Hags and stuff. 200. I love um, bouncing off bubbles. <laughs> Wait, that didn't make sense. How did he bounce on a bubble? I just downward stabbed it. <laughs> I, like, ah! I like how the ugly old hags throw fire that just sits there and doesn't do anything. Yeah, you can use the reflect spell to um, pretty much um, take out those fires. But, um... Nothing like you know, but they just like they, these are these are annoying, but the experience they give is worth it. One of the most boring parts of an RPG, grinding. Exactly, because that's not like I what I do RPGs. I grind the fuck out of the beginning of the game until I'm so overpowered. As soon as I get to the boss, <laughs> it's like ha ha ha. Here's a BB gun. Oh god, that was my 90, orb! 99, 99 damage, now how am I gonna get this key? Magic building blocks? 
It looks like I stumbled into into a Tetris game. So do those blocks kill you if they fall on you? Yes. Just like that. Ow! Not, not an instant kill. Those are the, those are the ghosts that that steal your experience points. So be careful. You will see those assholes later. I'm just gonna try to take them out. Yeah, I hit him and he went right through me. Ghosts. And he turned to fire. Yeah. Ooh. I love it when they drop magic. Hey, I yeah, I just kind of waited so I wouldn't have to deal with them. Uh, I don't see him anymore. No problem. And I just respawn. Yeah, the, these assholes come in three different flavors. Orange, red, and blue. Um, we, the colors of the rainbow. And I just got jacked by an iron knuckle. The orange one. And I get a free um, magic spell. I just love jump stabbing these guys. It makes it easy. And this will be the last palace where we see the orange iron knuckles. So they never show up again, ever. Not the orange ones, because the orange is the weakest one, weakest form. What? More hags. More ugly old hags. I don't know why I have to say it like that. You can say hags. 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 It sounds southern. Well, you, you do know how much... Yeah, I do realize we are the Carolina Retro Gamers, so yeah, we are in the South. Yeah, besides you being from, like, New York or something. I don't know what you're talking about. Talking about. Watch yourself, Ed. Uh, however. Hey, I'll just uh, watch yourself. You want to make fun of... Don't make fun of New York, okay? I'm not making fun of New York. I was making... I was more or less making fun of you. Ow. I'm trying to get that P. I want that P. Ow. So he hits you and that made you jump up higher. I cast jump. Oh. I just want the P back, okay? I would leave me alone. I want my P. I need it that back. back. You saw the Hammer Brothers reject, right? Yeah. Yeah, apparently Hammer Brothers, the Hammer Brothers retarded cousin is, is working for Ganon. Of course they are. So what... What else is different about this place? Because it doesn't look that... I don't uh, know. I'll, sh I'll probably point out where we fight, where we were supposed to fight Horse Head, because like, in this palace, it's a rematch with Horse Head and Helmet Head. Okay, yeah. here they Horse Head was the first boss of, um, Zelda was the first palace, and Helmet Head was the second boss, which you kinda admit, I kinda made look like a joke, um, because I got the downward stab first. So that, that sounds really lazy, the fact that just the bosses are just like, gen, like just reuse bosses, that's really lazy. Mmm, uh, uh, sort of, but, you know, well look at Mega Man, you have a, bo a boss rush. There's a difference between boss rush versus the main game where you have to fight the same dudes over and over and again. I don't know how I didn't hit that old hag. Ugly old hag. But see when that, you know, when that... <laughs> Ow! Come on. Oh yeah, ben, by the way, man, get used to this room. Lay out of this room. Is it gonna show up another five times? Probably, and I probably might backtrack. Give me that pee. I remember back when 50 points didn't mean something. Give me some life. And yes, I'm trying to clear the bubbles out so I wouldn't have to worry about dodging them. And then I'll take care of those, um... Do the bubble dudes not respawn? The bubbles respawn, but any other enemy doesn't, so... And I think this room looks sort of familiar. Oh, and by the way, um... Dan, you should, um, have you played Smash Brothers? Yes, I have. You played Melee? Yeah. Did you do the, um, action thing? Action. Hey, yeah, yeah, the little puzzle mini game thingy. Not the puzzle, but like you know the quest where you like plat doing a like, platforming. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, I remember that. Does this sound familiar? Um, no. You don't remember the Zelda stage where you um? I remember the Zelda stage. I just the don't Palestine? remember. Palestine. I just really don't remember the music for it. 
Um, yeah, I am trying to avoid that fight in the blue iron knuckles. Or am I? So, how are those guys? How tough are those guys? They're the toughest ones. You, you see how they throw their knives. And you don't want to fight them in closed corridor, closed corridors, because it is hard, hard to fight. But you know they're like one of the tougher enemies, especially like the blue enemies are like the tougher class, toughest class. So, in Ganon's henchman army, you have orange, orange red, and blue. Ugh. Blue, the true color of darkness. Of course. Yeah, I was trying to avoid that level. <laughs> hey, look, it's the Hammer Brother reject. My god, he throws a lot of those things. <laughs> I guess Bowser, I guess Bowser um, thought he was too aggressive. That would be perfect for, perfect in his war against Mario. What are you talking about? He should yeah. hire that guy. Like, this room kind of looks familiar. <laughs> hey, 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 buddy. I just like how they're throwing the hammers. They're like, ooh, pee! Watch out! Alright, level up! Awesome! What are we getting? I don't know. I don't know if I hold out to level 4, but to 4,000. 4, yep, I hold out! I guess because I max, I max out my life. Because 8 is the max level. Really? Yeah. When do you get the next? When by the time, well, uh, hopefully when I beat up beat up this palace, then yes, this guy's kicking my ass because I have jump equipped. Because eh, my jump stab doesn't work as well. But we should be um, approaching the end of this. Hopefully by the end of this part, since I'm at like thirty six thousand, and since these old hags give out two hundred experience points, I think two old hags would do it. Two ugly old hags. Yes. Hag. Unless I get, unless they decide to drop a red um magic jar. Come on, say hags like hags. Hags, they good. Um, at three hundred now. I just wish these um things would spawn near me so I can um downward stab them. Nope, shoot fire from like five uh, miles away from me. Yeah, it won't do anything. This is one reason why I kind of hate this palace. Haha, ha, take fire that's nowhere near you. Ha! No, come Rawr. closer! Rawr. Right, one more, one more um, 200 experience or 100 experience points to do it. Ooh. And I just found my next victim. Come on. And boom. So I, I get the option to level up again. And, and my life, life is, my life is maxed out. So, you said I, you get like it. So, is there, so you can't get any more health than 8? No, 8 is the max. Why isn't 10 the max? Or 9? Ask Miyamoto. I think 9 would at least... It would have been the, it's the last Well, digit. here's the thing. When you max out everything, I have everything at level 8. Next time you level up, um... Is when... I think, yeah, this is where the boss is. The, the horse head boss is. So where that blue guy is? Yeah, instead of instead of fighting um instead of fighting um this blue iron knuckle, you fight horsehead. And you went through a wall. Yes. He was guarding that. But Palace Six officially uh, um int introduces um mini bosses or sub bosses or whatever you want to call these call them. But this is the way to get to the um dungeon item. So what's our useless item that will never be used outside of this place again? Um, in the fifth dungeon of the first Zelda game, do you remember what we get? In the first? In the first Zelda game. Fifth um, dungeon. yeah, I'm trying to think, um, uh, the loot thing? You got it on the first try. Really? Yeah. Well, so what's it doing in this game? Okay. There's this, um, obstacle we have to move with the loot. Um, and to make Palace 6 appear. Okay, so it's Pal just hidden for no reason? Yeah, the 6th palace is called Hidden Palace. That makes sense. You should see how I get to the um, next town. How I get to the next town. That town's hidden. Why? People live there. Well, Hidden Town of Ka well, Kazuto, which will be seen in the next part.
All right, man. Remember this room again? Yes. God, this game is really lazy with the placements. Pretty much. Okay. Yeah, I'm getting a reminder, and we'll get the item in the next part. I'll see you in the next part. See you.